Hey folks, Alternate Bit here, and basically I'm doing today a kind of a ratcheting uh, or drum roll technique here. Obviously this could be done with a drum machine quite simply, but when doing modular it's always fun to explore your own method of creating things. So what I've got going on to do this is the trigger sequencer, the Moon trigger sequencer, triggering this Vermona DRM. Kick drum is on the first row, hi-hat on the second. If I want to roll this hi hat, make it you know kind of go faster. I'm using the clock denominator multiplier since I already have the tempo established with the current clock going at the full speed that it is. And to be able to shift that into a fast mode rather than manually constantly turning the dial, I'm using the sequential switch that is then triggered by the gates of another sequencer. It's obviously going to go by the duration of the opening and closing of that switch or switching. So watch this. I'll make it longer this time. Another cool thing I discovered, just a manual technique, is if you hold the reset button on the beat, you can do this. Anyway. Just some cool little tactics I just figured out. I've also been using this quad switch matrix a lot now for manually turning drums on and off. Before I used to always just pull the patches out and then push them back in. But I like, that's why I moved this over here so I can have all this for percussive control via modular. This is All Train Bit, thanks for watching.